This uh, exhibition, traveling exhibition that we launched in January of this year, we launched it at the George Price Center for Peace and Development in January. Um, it's a traveling exhibition. We've been to Punta Gorda and we've been to Dangriga, and now we, we, we have it here in Belize City at the Museum of Belize. Um, and it's all about you know sharing with the Belizean people um, the writings, the speeches of the premier, because these are speeches given when George before independence, when George Price was the premier of Belize during his fight for self-government and independence. So it's critically important. We have it's great to see the young students here today um, from primary school and high school um, who you know were born obviously um, long after independence. Um, so it's important for us to promote and preserve this great history and to share it with these young people and to share it with researchers. So I think it's a, a great event. Um, it's made even more significant today because for the first time as a part of the exhibition, we have the instruments of independence. Um, you know, obviously it's, it's a birth certificate for our country. Um, and this document was... Um, you know, locked away for 42 years in, in, a, in a draw, really, at, in the office of the clerk of the National Assembly. No fault of anyone, um, just everyone felt that that was perhaps the safekeeping it would be preserved there. But the truth is that it does belong in the National Archives and Records Service. And so we were very happy that through the initiative of the Speaker of the House, the President of the Senate, working along with the Belize Archives, um, we were able to sign an MOU uh, that the actual instruments which are on display here today um, would be handed over to the archives for permanent keeping and safe keeping. Um, so I think it's a, it's a fantastic occasion and we look forward to you know, all Belizeans coming here to see the exhibition.